welcome to my new vlog today. Now, hope you are doing okay. Hope you're having a great week. And uh, I'm okay. I'm feeling okay. I'm a little bit nauseated at the time still. But we had a good night last night at the Railway Hotel. And what I didn't expect is that when we got there, supposed to be having different artists, singers there. And, but apparently, <laughs> I was the only one there to sing, yeah, and so they had me singing around about 30 odd songs, so I sort of kept the night going, because there were people there listening, and they were, they were really enjoying it, what I, uh, what I was singing, so, um, and then we were threatening ourselves later, around about nine-ish, I think it was, that we were going to, you know, pack it up, pack up, um, until um, Emerson, came along. Thank you, Emerson, for uh, singing your songs. So uh, she came along and sang her songs. Um, that was really a wonderful, great night. And uh, it was a good night. It really was. And uh, so they really had me singing over about 30 songs. <laughs> so um, the musicians that were there, they don't sing. You know, they only play their instruments. And that's it. So I'm the only singer. <laughs> so... Um, no, it went okay, it went alright, and um, yeah, so it was a little bit different than the concert that I did in the afternoon yesterday, um, because of course yesterday um, I almost uh, collapsed actually, because I was getting exhausted, really, because everything was going around me, and um, and I was due, due to collapsed, so I thought, well, I'm pulling the pin straight away, and that's it, tell the folks, sorry, goodbye, you know. <laughs> And uh, so I end up with a drink of water after a while, but I'd rather do that rather, I'd rather pull it out rather than collapsing on the floor with my guitar. I, people don't want to see that. So, um, I mean, if you're an Arthur singer or anything like that and you're starting to feel dizzy, if you think you're going to collapse or anything like that, okay, stop and um, rest. Yes. So what I'm looking at um, this year... I'm taking it up till Christmas that um, I'm no longer going to be doing concerts for the elderly people. Um, look, I've been at it for quite a while, since, what, 93? 1993, and I've done over, probably well over 1,000, probably nearly get about 2,000 concerts that I've done for the elderly people, and I've done very well, really. And um, I think it's time to really pull the pen a bit and uh, to stick to the uh, the open mic nights that I really enjoy around the pubs, uh, just doing spot work, sort of thing like that, you know. But when it's, when it comes to concerts, you know, I think really uh, what I happened what happened yesterday, um, I'm thinking to myself, I don't think I, can, I think I don't think I can handle this anymore, you know. That's what I've said to myself. I can't handle this anymore, you know. I'm getting I'm getting older. Maybe it's that, or it's my health is playing up on me. And uh, so, you know, you've got to make a change, really. You've got to, you've got to sort of step back and think, you've got to look after your health, and that's what I'm doing. So, mm. so I hope you're having a great day. So um, I'm going to put it on yesterday's vlog, which I did yesterday in this vlog. So you'll enjoy that. that do you recognize that tune yeah if you've been following elton john um well that's the music song for guy yes that's what right, you got it and um it's a beautiful music i just love it i mean he does it on the piano and uh but after sort of i tried on the guitar then you know, it's really good i got the chords <laughs> mate trev Welcome. Today is Wednesday, 9th of October. Yes, I'm looking at the calendar. <laughs> and uh, 
it's a beautiful sunny day outside, lovely morning, and um, and I'm just sort of been practicing songs. I've got a concert to do today, and plus I've got an open mic to go to at the Railway Hotel tonight, so I'm just sorting out some songs. What I'm going to do today and tonight, so I've got a busy day. <laughs> so anyway, it's morning. It's about eleven o'clock, so. Um, some songs and sorting them out and uh, those uh, wondering how I'm feeling um, I'm feeling okay um, that's fine it's no drama look I just get my stomach just gets bloated after a while and uh, it's got full of toxins in there it just won't come out it gets from the throat too um, because it's a lot of water or fluid try to get in but it's hard to get down to the stomach I think that's what it is so um, I just got to take it easy with food and drinks, and uh, so I'll be seeing my doctor in this week. So um, hopefully I can get an appointment in and get some medication. Yeah, yeah get some medication and uh, get that healed quickly. Oh yeah. So anyway, how are you doing? That's good. And uh, I've been busy in the last few days with my community driving. Um, I've had two big busy days taking customers. And uh, so that was alright, that fulfilled my days. And of course last Monday night, uh, Frank and I went down to the river to um, do, do a little bit of planning for our next episode of East Side, West Side, Time to Kill. And uh, so hopefully we'll do it this weekend, I can't guarantee, um, that depends on Graham. Uh, Manny, Manny, remember Manny? <laughs> it depends on his availability. Yeah. So anyway, it's a gorgeous day out. And uh, I've got to be loading up very soon uh, my sound equipment. Yeah, and get with it. <laughs> <sighs> now, I'm just about ready to go and do my concert. Yeah, so um, all ready, rest up. <laughs> and it's a beautiful day outside. And I'm feeling okay. And uh, just a matter of uh, keep getting active, keep walking around, standing up. I feel I feel okay then. So um, it's usually you know, I'm lying down at night or in the morning, early in the morning. That's when the stomach starts to irritate. Yeah. So anyway, I shall I'll see you shortly. Okay. I'm all ready to do my concert. I've been here for quite a long. I've been here. For, I started here in 1993. This is where I first started my first concert. Well, it wasn't in this building. It was in another area, Ford Street. So um, I think this came to being in around about two, year 2000. So, um, but anyway, I'm here to do a concert, so I think the only people love it. It's a beautiful day out, so I'm all ready. See you after. See you after the concert. I'm just about to go to um, pick up my brother and uh, we're just going to chill out. We're just going out to Millerwall Bakery, out to Millerwall, a little small town. So and at the moment it's very cloudy and uh, there was no clouds earlier. <laughs> so um, they reckon they're forecasting for a bit of rain So uh, and also on the weekend. Hmm. Not good. <laughs> I don't want rain. <laughs> well, well, the farmers need it, don't they? Yeah, so, now it looks like um, we've had a discussion with Frank Mackay uh, in regards to our film, 
east side, west side, time to kill. And at the moment we're experiencing the actors, um, at the moment, they're not consistent enough. So they need to be there um, to do the filming. So, I mean, with Graham, um, who act as Manny, um, he's pretty well tied up with, with his band that he plays in. So, you know, we, we need consistent actors, so we just can't find them at the moment. So, anyway, we're going to have to um, wind it up, um, east side, west side, time to kill. So, um, we, there's no more of that at the stage. But we're going to continue with some other films. Remember the film I did called um, End of Time? End of Time, there was just me walking down along the railway track and um, looked like a hobo sort of thing, you know. I'm going to continue with that, hopefully. And so um, I've got some ideas to do that. Hmm. So that'll be in the future. So there's other films I do. So as far as I'm, I'm concerned, um, well, as far as I know, East Side, West Side, Time to Kill has ended, unfortunately. But look. You can go back to have a look at all the episodes that we've done, and uh, we've done well. And, uh, and I want to thank you, all you followers uh, watching our film, East Side, West Side, Time to Kill. I suppose it's not going to go on forever, is it? <laughs> Nothing lasts forever. So, uh, but anyway, there's lots of other opportunities, lots of other um, exciting um, titles, uh, films that we can do. Hmm. Yeah. Anyway, I'm going to go and see Peter and... Um, take him out. Hmm. Now we've just had a cuppa and a, something to eat at the Millerwall Bakery. Yeah, so now we're heading back to our car, my car here. Yeah. I'm back. It's locked. Now, I'm in, just called into Coles to do a little bit of shopping. So, I brought, I took Peter home, my, back to where he lives, and uh, I just had tea actually, the Mexican restaurant, so I had a couple of uh, quesadillas, quesadillas, yeah, I love those, just had a couple of those, just to satisfy my hunger a bit, so I'm right, and so now I'm just going to do a bit of shopping in Coles, just get a f bit of food, get what I need, so uh, and it's a very cloudy day and uh, pretty humid. So, of course, this weekend it's our Wangaratta show. On Friday and Saturday, Wangaratta show. It's on. And I'm not sure if I'm going to be there or not. Um, that depends on what I'm doing. So, uh, yeah. So, anyway, I'll catch you shortly. Oh, yeah. Hear the screeching cockatoos. It's late in the afternoon. It's coming on dusk. <laughs> so, and there's my car. Yeah, sitting idle in my backyard. <laughs> of course, tomorrow it's going to be a sad day because I'll have to leave that car. I'll have to go and pick up my own. I'll have to get my own car back <laughs> tomorrow sometime. Hopefully, it'll be back in time. That damage on the car, my car. Um, hopefully, it'll be all um, ready for me to pick up tomorrow. So and then it'll be a goodbye to this beauty. Yeah, sadly. <laughs> but it's been a beautiful car, really. It's it's a it's a Rav Four, R A V Four. It's four wheel drive, and um, I just fell in love with it. <laughs> I wanted to, uh, I wanted to keep it, God, but can't have it forever <laughs> but anyway i'm going to finish this vlog and hope you enjoyed and i shall see you tomorrow which will i'll don't forget smoothie trev will come along to make your smoothie it's going to be a healthy smoothie too as well so stay tuned anyway i'm okay and um i shall see you tomorrow which will be friday create harmony peace bye i gotta mow this lawn sometime Again. <laughs> Bye.